Hi, Sajis. Hi, Sajis. We'll do a reading for August 2018 for the 1st till 15th for the sign of Sagittarius, Moon, Rising, and Venus. And let's see what's coming towards Sagittarius for the August 1st from 1st to 15. What's bringing here? I shuffle a lot and I'm still shuffling a little bit. Till one minute, probably I'll shuffle. Let's see. This. It's for Sagittarius and Moon Rising from the 1st till 15th of August 2018. Okay. All right. Overall energy, you have 10 of Pentacles. Okay. 10 of Pentacles, that's happiness. That's growth, money, pentacles, that's Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn. Let's see what else could bring this half of months. First card, we have the hangman, major arcana. Okay. Okay. Somebody's in limbo. Somebody doesn't know that it's coming happiness for them this first of half of months. Let's see what's next. Ooh, the Wheel of Fortune. This is karma. Somebody's coming back probably, or something is finishing. Maybe you are single and you'll turn out to be coupled. Or somebody's coming from your past because Wheel of Fortune brings past people. But you don't think you're moving, but you're moving because you're still here in limbo. Oh, somebody's sneaky. Somebody conflicted. Seven of Swords. That's Aries. No, that's. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Somebody done something to you and they are pretty sneaky. Which you've been lovers with the person. You love the person. Okay. Maybe the Gemini. The Gemini is coming towards you. We'll see. Let's see. Or a chorus because this person for you is wish fulfillment. Star is a very positive card. Sagittarius. Do you wish for a quiet? Do you wish for Gemini? Hmm. But this person is your love you have with this person ten of you have with this person ten of coins ten of pentacles let's see what bring this person towards you okay this person is out of distance Sagittarius and he's thinking to come to not come but I think he is coming or this person still in limbo because he doesn't know to move or not let's see what the next card will bring to us ah he or she is carrying a burden because of the past the past which he want to turn 
to get in reverse. Usually I don't read reverse results. But the person or you keep a burden. But the person is at out of distance. Might be a water sign, maybe a Scorpio, Cancer or Pisces. Or it's a person who has a lot of emotions towards you. The person loves you probably. And ah, king and queen. But they do not face together, they are facing backwards. So that means they are not together because somebody's out of distance. And between you guys is a lot of burdens. One of you, either the queen, either the king, it's carrying a burden. But this couple love each other. If you see, it's loving here. But now these persons, these two are not together. Not together. Because they live out of distance. But they are a couple, okay? And they might come together because in the past these two people had ten of pentacles, which been harmony, happiness, and love, okay? All right, let's see. Death. Usually I don't read them in reverse. I don't know why death came in reverse. But I'll read it in reverse because it came up like this. Something is not ending. And you probably or the person doesn't want to end because you used to have a lot of happiness okay a wish this person was a star for you your star your wish fulfillment or vice versa okay so now I don't know why this card came in reverse but now this person gets out of this Eight of Swords, which is Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, which he or she used to feel blindfolded and trapped. Now it is not. And probably is thinking, yes, I've stayed like this, I've been like this, but I want to move. Let's see how and where. Yep, the person make a choice. Made a choice. I will go where I want to go towards the prison, and probably this king want to come towards you, which you are fire sign. This king could be any sign, but I think this is you guys couple. And I don't think this king is a water sign. Look, it's coming with the afro. He made his choice out of distance, but he will give you an afro. And for the queen. Probably in the past was a sneaky situation towards you guys, 
Who knows? I don't know. But comes with a offer which is not way too big. Maybe it's mostly a passionate offer. A really one really really small but this person loves you and maybe want love from you let's see but this person is pretty defensive still this king which is your love he wants to give you the offer but very defensive because in the past he was like my way or the highway he didn't thought that hey you are gone so I don't think so we'll work it out but he is coming back because he made the choice but either you either him you guys out of distance but yes, there are two movement cards, and I'll show you. It's a Cancerian person towards you, fire sign. I don't know, but it's a movement. The person want to move where you are, or you are moving where the person is. But it's gonna make movement. Because you are their wish fulfillment, okay? Something is not finishing here, it's unfinished business, and they moving towards you, or it's vice versa. Okay? And they are moving to you, okay, because they're mourning. They know they lost you and they're mourning towards this connection of yours, guys. Okay. And they want to put you into work toward this relationship it was in the past a three third part three party situation because three shows me my be in the past three party but this card is three pentacles which show me that the person or you want to put into the effort and yeah, here's the judgment. The judgment card, which is a family, happy people and a child. Maybe the child involved in this. And yeah, maybe the Virgo coming towards you and is contemplating, hey, should I stay or should I not? Should I go to this person or not to go? Let's see. Might be, but... Okay. Yeah, might be a 3 party situation because... Probably this person got broken up from a person and it's coming got broken up from a person and it's coming towards another person which yeah we're a three party situation and yeah might be a Virgo might be a water sign might be any sign okay but the chariot it's towards this person which is Queen of Pentacles towards Virgos and Capricorn and that's how show me or this person having the chart towards Virgo Capricorn but 
this king it's moving towards this person because they have unfinished business you can see and this person this king well, wish fulfillment for this person for this queen because this queen was nurtured to the person in the case okay all right let's put some angel cards and we'll finish the reading with this angel cards give me an insight for Sagittarius for the first half of month of August 2018 give me an insight okay between you and this person you have religious factors which your love life is influenced by your religious upbringing and spiritual path you are not the same religious or you are not the same nationality or you are from different places that caused you so much to be out or separated by each other yep you had the separation in the past due to this religious factors due to these differences to say that separation time apart of friends on the horizon okay let's see what's next coming and healing family issues that's why this person is coming towards you to heal because might be kids involved might be not but this person want to talk and see if they can bring stability bring calmness waters who knows and yeah this could be the one you already met the romantic partners you seek okay yeah maybe this person is coming back to you and of course he is because he's out of distance and yes you will get to know each other as you reveal your innermost souls to each other your bond deepens okay and the last card for this you have the engagement your love life is ascending to higher level of commitment maybe this person is coming for apology that have been created this three-party situation or this person was a pretty sneaky person and cheated on you that's why you are not were here and yes you guys have chemistry okay you love each other so okay and yeah this is your reading Sagittarius for the first 15 days of August 2018 bye